Okay, so first I'm John Osini. I'm one of the top 100 child prodigies in the world. A multi-taxing developer. Uh, they have said everything. So um, first I was awarded the top 100 child prodigies award as um, in the technological category whereby someone actually saw my post and was like, oh John, what do you do? I contributed to some of Bitcoin, also some open source codes. I also um, contributed to like top companies that are confidential because I'm not eating for now. So when I'm eating, I'll cast it, don't worry. So first, I'm a type of guy that thinks about the future. I don't just think about um, problems about now because um, softwares get deprecated and um, if you have a complaint, it's software based. I'm not accusing your complaint. But trust me, you get greedy in the long way. You'll be like, oh, oh, blockchain is raining. I want to change my complaint from normal web 2 to web 3. Web 4 will come out now. You say you want to change to web 4. Web 5 too will come and you want to change to web 5. So we think about the future, whether you have a nature powered vehicles just like Elon Musk. The question you ask Elon Musk today is um, um, how many years do you want to take to install electric chargers all over the whole world? So um, the future is all about think. First, the question you ask yourself is, can I do it? Yeah, everybody can do it, because I just started last year, and it's not about how fast, it's about how fast, how well. Oh, they know you can ask how fast, self, but the thing is just, have something to give, be useful. I will tell you today that all the jobs I have today, I didn't apply for it. And there was a time I started off on LinkedIn, I was applying to Microsoft, I was applying to lots of jobs. All of them rejected me, but all the jobs I have today are referrals. In fact, I don't even know if I have a CV because it's just it's referrals. When you actually volunteer, first volunteer, let people know what you do. Let people, because I was young then and people did not believe that, okay, I can build this. So I just sat down, built this one, volunteered, created my school website. I met with Onyo Ovife. I just met with top people that actually like me invested in me and everything and the second one is is it possible yes everything is possible in life you can become the best you can become one of the best not the best because it's hard to become the best today you can just become one of the best so um how can i the question is how can i look at people that look at people that have already gotten it uh look at them ask yourself how did they do it because um First, pardon my mood of dressing is because I'm not successful yet. I'm not successful, but I've not failed, right? All the people that have come off stage are successful people, right? So the thing is just, don't worry. Uh, by God's grace, I will be successful by God's grace. Who will help? First, the question is nobody will help you when you are starting. You have to help yourself. Nobody wants to get kind of tangled with um, someone that is kind of starting from scratch. If you are starting from scratch, you have to... You have to grind, like you just have to, you have to have sleepless nights. You have to grind, let people know that you can do what they cannot do. Let, let, let people know that, oh, I have the brain that you can think of. Let people know that um, I can achieve what you can achieve. Have mentors, but don't just have mentors to forever look up to them. Have mentors so that you can be greater than them, right? Don't just, people you look up to, tend to have a mentality to be greater than them. Don't just say, okay, I have a mentor. Is it forever going to be your mentors? I'm telling you, we are human beings. I had a mentor, okay, let me give you a story. I had a mentor then and, um, okay, and she came up and the mentor wanted to use everything he knows about me to actually blackmail me. In fact, I will, advi I will advise you have mentors that don't know you. So you'll be like, okay, you'll be inspired to, okay, let me look up to this person. This person must know my name. This person must know I exist. And look at me today, I, had, I remember I had the goal of having like three awards this year. I got three awards. I had the goal of leaving Nigeria. I left Nigeria. In fact, the, the, the favor and everything just came in. I, like, I, just, I, I left Nigeria to Dubai, not just to go on tourism. It's not just for tourism. It's to go and collect an international award and everything. In fact, my visa processing was the, it was the government of Dubai that kind of just processed everything for me. So it was not just kind of an ordinary trip. So I would just advise you that um, in life, a, don't, don't have a mentality to, um, okay, you have money now, you stay there. No, you need more. This, the, the goal is to be number one. It's not only to be national, be international. Don't just think of, um, okay, I want to become like, um, 
all these tech influencers, yeah, be like them, be more than them. You can be more than what you are today, right? And also, um, bad situations don't last. Um, I remember the time I was kind of being played on because uh, um, I was a kid and um, they were like, okay, John, build, imagine you're telling me to build something like Ethereum for like maybe 1 million Naira or 1.5 million. Who does that? So, but I just, I was just like, okay, let me use this to test myself. I did it and in fact, the person saw it was good. It was not like, oh, I don't, I don't like this. He wants to take back his money. And people tend to play on young people like that. Actually, it would actually tell on me, even though because of um, the network I had. I've, I've increased your network. Like, I had a barista of barista as my lawyer. That was actually what kind of helped me, you know. So increase your network, network of people, know people more. Change your mentality, not just the Nigerian mentality. We all can be better than where we are today. You can be bigger than Elon Musk. You can be so, so bigger than Elon Musk. And um, I, I know all of us are thinking that um, the, tech, the tech space is crowded. It's not. The tech space is not crowded at all, at all. You just take a genius, someone that can think extraordinarily, that, okay, what do you think? Okay, let me just say, I have two complaints, Ultrex and Acronex. Ultrex is a nature-powered complaint. We are bringing in nature-powered phone, nature-powered vehicles, nature-powered everything, every, anything you can be think of. Because um, I'm not tired of seeing your phone in 0% and everything. So uh, all I'll just say is, just do something exceptional. That will make you so unique. Thank you.